Well, guys, it's officially time. I get my core team here. I'll take all this shit off. It's too hot for this shit. Up here, about to get a haircut. Brought the truck today. I see my boy Gerardo's up here too. One another just trucking member. And then Arturo's SS over here. Boy got them starters. If anybody in Ford need a haircut, there you go. Hit up my boys. Oh, it is. It is. This new SS don't make me want to build an SS for real. Can't wait to get his wheels put on. Shit on my hair. This too. Too much going on. Yeah. What about? You're, you're rolling through downtown. Uh, Damn, here we're getting that fresh fade in here. Gotta got get ready for the show season. Yeah, well, all this shit gotta go now. At least, hey, I picked it out for you though. This nigga here in his damn balloons. Or popping balloons and shit. No, I can This nigga Fuck the hair. Yeah, we're good. Done now. Time to go back to work. Well, guys, I'm done. Shout out to my boy Joe for hooking up on the, the haircut. Now time to get back to the shop because I got the customer that's been waiting on me. And I forgot he was coming, honestly. Woo-hoo! Only thing is, in pictures that don't show is they show they don't show these little things right here. Like little nicks and nacks and all that stuff. That's a lot, bro. That's a lot. That's a lot. That scratches everywhere. Shit, mine do too, bro. I'm telling you, like, look. The other day I ran, I, I fucking parked on the fence and didn't know I parked on the fence and they did that. And then my dog did this. And then a, trying to get on top of Yeah, and then a body shop did this, trying to adjust my bumper. And you know how Stag Leo has his no gap? Yeah. I was trying to do that too. How but, do you do that, bro? That's what I'm trying to do. Man, it looks like I'm gonna have to go to Houston to get it done, honestly. Cause I see some ghetto people, bro. Like they put, uh, they put a, a big long like uh, metal wire with like a little wash and it just, and it just comes up. I might have to try it, but then again, at the same time, I might just take it to Houston. Like, the, the bad thing is that, bro, you can see everything from right here. You, you can see that wire? Yeah, you see the, the big ass stick coming through. Yeah, yeah, no, I ain't doing that then. Yeah, that's what I was saying. That's not an option, fuck that. <laughs> that's what I say, right now, it don't matter if it's stock or whatever you, you say it is, but yeah, you yeah. got your nice little project. See, I had, I was gonna get these, but see, mine was the original. They were just black right here. Okay. But honestly, if I was, I I'd color match them. That's just me. That's my opinion. No, but yeah. I do like this no, hood I, though. I wanna color match the the, uh, the inside, bro. Yeah. That same color, blue color. Yeah. yeah, that'd be badass. I like this hood though. I was thinking about putting it on mine. Yeah. Bro, but I, I can't really find it. This, bro. For real, you, you trade it or you like pay? Uh, I, I, I bought this, the hood and the grill for 300 bucks, bro. God damn. In Irvin or over here? Over here in Man, damn it. What you, what you find it on? On Facebook, bro. Facebook Marketplace. For real? Yeah. Oh, shit. You got the little, the, the twisty spikes. Oh, that's like that, uh, what's that? Uh, I think it was like that V2, the version 2, bro. I don't know. I've never heard of it. Yeah. Hey, but hey, I know one thing. You smart as hell. You got the ones with the, the, the grooves on it. Oh, yeah, yeah, Make yeah. sure nobody can take those off. Hey, what's the you talking about? This is the one thing I have to, uh, what I have to worry about right here. Just cut this one over Yeah, that right there. Okay. That right, yeah. You definitely gonna have to, that's gonna have to get bent. Okay. It's bent or cut it. Is it allowed? Hmm? See, look, this is pretty much, like, you, we're basically gonna get down at this same size. It's just gonna be a 40 instead of 45. That's, that's the only difference. Yeah, look, there she is. <laughs> 
what is it? What year is it? Uh, 05. 05? Yeah. Hey, that's same year as mine. Oh, yeah, mine's old fight. This is 99. Shut up. <laughs> Tell them what your channel is. Buen dia, media. Y'all can follow me. Subscribe. Let me know. I'll put the link down below in the, in the description so y'all can follow him. But yeah, hey, y'all stay tuned for his build though. We got wheels on the, by the order of wheels on Monday and he got a lot of his stuff planned out for it. Yeah, stay tuned. Probably gonna get him in just trucking too, watch. On a rainy day. That's when everybody works, rainy days. Yeah, you right on that one. Ooh. What are you doing over there, cutie? excitement uh, some people got into it over some look like some stupid stuff the guy was drunk so but yeah overall good turnout um, I want to give a shout out to sweet addictions for giving me some candy uh, if you want if you want some of these they're pretty good if you want some uh, go to their Instagram is sweet addiction so it's spelled just like this sweet addiction 20 check them out on Instagram also we don't want another trophy place top 30 Honestly, I didn't think we were going to place top 30. There was a bunch of clean trucks out there, but place top 30. So proud of that. Um, right now I'm about to go take, go take it home because for some reason I keep finding like little dents on the wheels and stuff. And then I had to, on the way here, hell, I had to stop like three times. I thought I, well, I do, on the second one, I did hit a bump, bump like really, really hard. I thought I messed up the wheel. But other than that, we're back in Fort Worth. Made it finally. About to drop it off. About to go see what Tony's doing. As you guys know, Tony's now a free man again. He parted ways with his fiance. Parted ways with his fiance, so help him move some beds and stuff into his house. But yeah, hey. It's gonna about to be Liddy, nigga. Liddy. Okay, guys, so. Brought the truck. I'm in the truck again. Uh, we're about to go to another shop. I know I only had it a few weeks, but gotta get ready for Banda. So I ended up talking, got in contact with a guy that works at Just Customs. Um, he told me, gave me a little, gave me a decent price. Told me the eighth. Today's the eighth. Going to go drop it off. I don't have time to be waiting. I can't even enjoy my truck because now it's rubbing to the point where it's cutting my tires on that side. So I can't keep waiting. I've already been waiting too long so <clears throat> he said he can get in in the eighth i don't know how long it's gonna take them to actually do it but as long as it's in the shop and they're getting worked on it that's fine with me because i mean i can't even enjoy it when cruising because this goddamn tire keeps hitting the fender so we're about to head over there right now i got my boy kike he's on his way over there to pick me up so we're gonna drop this one off so yes it's gonna be out the channel for a little bit more but once we get it back and then from there i gotta figure out who's gonna paint it and then we gotta get the trans and the stall put in so on the way to Just Customs, we go. What's up, guys? It's been a long time. I think, what? I think I ain't loaded about three weeks. Been pretty busy at the shop. The truck's been in the shop. The other truck's broke. But I'm back. Black truck's back. Got some new upgrades on it. Also, we've got some stuff we need to refix. And uh, I seen when I paid it up yesterday, but do we do finally got tubs. Um, Finally got tubs in, front back tubs, so no more rubbing. But one thing I didn't know about goddamn tubs is tubs are so fucking heavy. Like, I did not know tubs were so heavy. 
so there go the tubs got b-roll dog house with the b-roll on it but before i dropped the truck off we had already we had raised it back up i remember mean, if you look at one of the past videos we raised it back up now it's back at the same height before we raised it back up and if you can see a little bit on the wheels you can tell it's back lower because it's starting to like hit in certain spots but yeah we're tubbed up now inside no rubbing nowhere near can't see the sea notch no more so y'all can stop hitting me up talking about why i ain't got no tubs there, there goes the damn tub shut the hell up front tubs are done too but the front tubs are done but I ain't got no hood latch, so no hood latch. I can't hold. I can't hold it. But I'm damn so that hood fucking heavy. So I'll show you that later on. Later on today, when I get like around homeboys or something, they can hold it. It's nothing spectacular. They weren't able to b roll it like I wanted them to, but I needed tubs because it was rubbing really bad. So it's okay. It's okay. We'll we'll get that part figured out later on. Right now, I'm just glad to have it back. Almost three weeks without it. And it ain't going to no shop no time soon. I think in probably around the beginning of August, I'll take it to Extreme to get uh, some more upgrades to put on it. But, uh, ooh, let me put my mask on. As y'all know, four words on the mandated where you have to wear masks when you're out. So here goes my mask. Trumpet Tech Class of 2014. Always got a rip. And I'm getting the custom ones made for myself with my uh, Highlight logo on it. Also, my tent is finally done. I don't know if y'all been seeing it on Instagram, but Four or Five Martin has been really posting it, and I'm, I appreciate it. Yeah, we've been waiting on. It. I have some of the people that's uh, sponsored the tin, been blowing me up about it. But yeah, tin's finally done. Hopefully, get it within the next week or so. But yeah, hopefully, I can make a few photo shoot, video shoots, meets, or shows before the uh, DFW try to set, shut down the whole city again. Because like I said, they mandated to where we have to have masks, and a lot of people are already not even obeying that shit. So it's like. They're going to end up shutting the city down again. And we got two big shows coming up. Summer Truck Invasion and Bandas. Everybody's coming out for Bandas. So if Bandas get shut down, that would be some shit. I hope it don't happen, though. So we'll see, though. We'll see. If everybody just do what they need to do, listen to the damn news. I mean, shit. They won't keep making rules. But everybody want to say F the news and all of this stuff. Well, they're going to keep making rules. They're going to keep shutting stuff down. Okay, guys. So we're going to have to take this light back to Weezy. As you can see, I don't know what the fuck happened while I was at the other shop, but water. I think it did rain a few times and it was sitting outside most of the time at that shop. So water back in there. The wheels are sold, but the guy is waiting for half the bandas to pick them up. He's already gave me some cash, so the wheels are sold. But if bandas get canceled, then I'm gonna give him the wheels sooner than that. But the thing, the problem is, I don't know if I want to buy another truck build another truck or buy some new wheels the wheels i'm planning on getting and go ahead and slap those on so i'm undecided on that but yeah wheels wheels and tires are sold the box that's inside is sold already too sorry for the guys that hit me up we went about the wheels bought the box also so box wheels are sold just getting a whole new setup once we get the interior i don't know on the wheels yet either i'm gonna buy a brand new set of what i've been planning on getting and slap those on or buy a used set that's 28 all the way around and then buy something else buy something else and build it maybe a back truck 